interesting facts about famous people. The Top 10 Sexiest Bond Girls of All Time There are several types of Bond girls. Pussy Galore and Mayday were enemies of James Bond, working together with antagonists to bring down 007. Some, like Madeleine Swann and Tracy Bond, are devoted to James, becoming lovers for longer than just a quickie. So far there have been 79 Bond girls. It could be argued some of Bond's lovers would not count. Here are some interesting facts about the top 10 sexiest Bond girls. I must be dreaming. The iconic words uttered by Sean Connery. He was referring to the Who fact he's just woken up in the presence Pussy of Pussy Galore. Galore. Despite being the oldest woman to play a Bond girl, she I had to be, be in this list. Carol Bouquet as Melina Havelock in For Your Eyes Only. As the daughter of an assassinated MI6 operative, this feisty character was stunning to look at and had a way of getting her point across. Famke Jensen as Xenia on the top in GoldenEye. She had thighs to quite literally die for. This badass Bond girl was no pushover for 007, of course played by Pierce Brosnan. Eva Green as Vesper Lind in Casino Royale. She has a prickly demeanour but manages to get through Bond's armour and wins his heart. Halle Berry as Jinx in Die Another Day. Homages are usually well intended but unsuccessful in their execution. In Die Another Day, they evoked memories of I Ursula Andress appearing from the sea by dressing Halle Berry in a bikini on a beach in Cuba. Halle just looked amazing in that bikini. Homage accomplished. Maud Adams as Andrea in The Man with the Golden Gun and then in Octopussy. Maud played two roles while Roger Moore was James Bond. No. First appearing as Scaramanga's girlfriend in The Man with the Golden Gun and then as Octopussy in the film of the same name. Usually remembered for her role in the former. Diana Rigg in on Her Majesty's Secret Service. We can't leave out the only woman who tamed James Bond. Diana Rigg was already famous in the UK as she entertained audiences in the popular Avengers series. She also shot to fame as the only woman to marry James Bond. We can understand what Bond saw in her. Sophie Marceau as Electra King in The World Is Not Enough. We don't need to say much about this Bond girl come villain. She is French, smart, talented, ruthless and stunning. Ursula Andress as Honey Rider in Dr. No. The first girl to really wow in a James Bond movie was Ursula Andress. When she emerges from the ocean is one of the most iconic scenes in cinematic history. She usually tops these lists, but not today. Here is your number one, Jane Seymour as Solitaire in Live and Let Die. The 22-year-old Jane Seymour in Live and Let Die jumps into the top spot. We recommend you watch the movie to see what we're talking about. In fact, watch them all. There you have it, the top 10 Bond girls of all time. Thank you for your time today. I hope you liked the video. Please drop me your comments. I appreciate likes, shares and subscribers. It helps me a lot. Bye for now. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.